I see a lot of women getting the implants in LA. I live in Hollywood. I am not gonna put something foreign underneath my skin unless it can also do something to help my life, you know? Like hold change, you know? They have a twist off nipple, a buck 50 just comes out of there. You can park anywhere you want. Or I would totally get implants if they could also be easy bake ovens. <laughs> Because how cool would this be? Like, let's say I come up to you, I I meet you on the street, we have a little chat, and when we're done, I'm like, it was so great to see you. Fresh baked cookie. (laughs) Yeah, I got milk. (laughs) I feel like today, everybody's trying to be all hip hop, you know? You see these girls at the mall like, oh my God, Valerie, I just bought a pair of those sweatpants with the word on the butt. Mine says cracker. <laughs> so if I sit to the right a little bit and the ER rubbed off, so now it just says crack. <laughs> Been listening to pop music and I'm hearing all these white girls singing all gospely, you know? What a whore wants, what, you know that thing? You know, all these. These white girls singing, singing all gospel, like upper middle class girls. And, and, and the tradition of gospel music, it's all about soul and hardship and overcoming. And it's like, what do these girls really have to overcome in their lives? So I think if they're gonna sing like that, they should sing about something that's truthful and really uh, emotionally affecting them. You know, so you'd start to hear songs like, Well, I looked down and saw that I had broken a nail. So I went to the manicure shop. And the lady, oh, the lady, well, she looked up at me and she said, no more appointment today. And I said, help me, help me, help me, Korean lady. But she turned to me and said, get out store, I call police. Thanks, guys. I'm Bethany Drew.